hi all see this this is a problem of summation summation of in infinite no sorry finite series because here we have that 15 term of the series so obviously you see that for this kind of problem it is necessary to write down the general term or understand the general way of representing that that the in it term r it term whatever you called it okay so that's the easiest way to solve this kind of problem so here first we go ahead and consider the sum right now see that in that particular sum right we see that all the terms are actually in the mixed fraction form and it is difficult to me understand the mixed fraction form so just convert it in a normal fraction p by q form what's that it is 3 by 2 this is 9 by 4 and so on right so if i go ahead and write down that particular way we can see this is 3 by 2 whole cube 9 by 4 whole cube and all that stuff now see that uh, if i try need to find out a general formulation of all these series right now what is the general form right see that most of the cases our denominator Denominator are actually 4 okay except few cases so we can change that where if the denominator is 4 it is 6 by 4 okay now uh, that term is also can be changed right 3 cube 3 cube means it's 3 into 4 12 12 by 4 right so that's why we now get it a general representation what's that we can understand that first term is 3 second is 6 third is 9 so the numerator r goes on in the form of 3 multiplied by r right so in r equal to 1 we get the first term second term and so on for r equal to 1 2 3 and all the stuff right and all the cases my denominator are 4 right so therefore this can be easily written as uh, in this form as the 15 term and here we can understand that r -th term will be written as 3 r by 4 whole cube right so here we can easily see the sum is actually n equal to 1 to 15 3 r by 4 whole cube right so that's actually the sum right now see that here this 3 by 4 sum if i'm trying to obtain our job is done let's go ahead so let's go ahead with that okay so let's consider that 3 r by 4 whole cube right now see that here 3 by 4 is a constant now we know that that if it is a constant term that will always comes out from this summation right so if it is comes out from the summation it gives you 3 cube by 4 and summation of r cube right that's it let's take that so therefore it became as 27 by 64 actually here we wrote it as 3 cube by 4 cube so 3 27 by 60 cube and r cube okay now what is summation r cube or n equal to 1 to 15 that gives you sum of fast uh, 15 cube natural number right so that's why that formula gives you n into n plus 1 divided by 2 whole square so here n is equal to 15 right so the 15 term so 15 into 15 plus 1 and 2 now this is a simple calculation we have to do that and if we go ahead step by step we'll get, get that the final answer is 225 into 27 right you can multiply that but here it's not required because it's oxford that 225k so therefore we can easily understand that the values of k is 27 right so that's it so that's why we'll say that for this particular problem the correct answer is 27 and that's it hope you understood the problem thank you